Thailand literature. Thai literature was traditionally and heavily influenced by Indian culture. Early Thai literature was primarily concerned with religion and until the mid 19th century was in verse form. Thai verse was written exclusively by the aristocracy or royalty, the only educated classes able to do so. The tradition of authorship by kings can be seen in all periods of the country's history, from Sakathai up to Bangkok. Two Chakri monarchs, King Rama II, 1809 to 1824, and King Rama VI, 1910 to 1925, were distinguished poets and stalwart patrons of Thai arts. One of the most important Thai literary works is the Ramakayan, a unique Thai version of Indian epic, the Ramayana. Early Thai versions of the Ramakayan were lost in the destruction of Ayutthaya. The longest of the three present versions was written in 1798 by the first Chakri king, Rama I. In a group of entomates who incorporated the Thai and Buddhist elements into it to preserve the oral knowledge of Ayutthaya state rites and tradition. Ended, King Rama I's Ramakayan is the major historical source of medieval Thai courtly traditions. King Rama II composed two episodes of Ramakayan for classical drama, proposed and wrote several other epic poems, including the Ayaneo, a romance with a Javanese background. The Ayaneo is a treasure trove of historical information on early 19th century Thai customs, habits, and manners, and figures prominently in the repertoire of classical drama. Both King Rama V and Rama VI were also distinguished writers whose creativity contained the rich intellectual heritage in several process and verse forms. Among outstanding literary works of King Rama V were Gopa and the well-known collection of Kwai Ben or Far Away From Home on his journey to Europe in 1906-7. Those well-known works of King Rama VI were Matha Nafata, Fra Nan Kam Lueng, and several patriotic articles entitled Mueng Tang Choi Tun Tuoi or Wake Up All Thais and etc. It was inevitable that Thai artists in the age of technology would find new subjects and forms expressions in addition to more foreign influences. The arts have begun to move in different directions which modern Thais can relate to. Yet, the beauty of the old has not lost its beauty to inspire, and despite the inroads made by modern culture, it continues to hold its own and even to show signs of revival in many areas. Thank you.